Okay, y'all, I'm gonna be 100% honest with you. I am shook about this wig. Like, I have been dying for a feathered bang for a while. Like, do you see how wispy and adorable these bangs are? And then the bounce in this hair. Look at that. And she came like this. Like, she came out of the box with these bouncy, soft curls. So dreamy. Like, and, and she's glueless, okay? I don't have anything on her. I just styled the bangs to my liking, which, by the way, very easy because you have so much lace to work with and play with. And again, this came styled. So all these little feathered pieces, not cut by me, already came like that. All I did was decide how much hair I wanted in this section, and wow, just, whoa. <laughs> so if you are looking for a quality wig that is coming to you with this already done, okay? Styled, cut, keep watching. Just keep watching. <laughs> okay, so let's get into the details of this wig. Trust and believe all the, the links, description, everything you're gonna need is gonna be down below. So make sure you check that out if this is the wig that you've been looking for. But it's called Wigs by Charisse. It's in a silky texture, 18 inch, and this is in the size one, which is between one and a half to one and a half, 21 and a half, sorry, to 22 inches. Now I do follow more of a 21 and a half. This wig does come with an elastic band that is sewn in. It is not the kind that you can, you know, um, just remove with like the little hooks. It is a sewn in band, but trust and believe if you don't want the band, you can always cut it out. So make that clear. Also, you always have the little hooks in the, the back of your, your band here, so you can always adjust that way. And if absolutely needed, you can always use a wig grip headband. That's my go-to if I ever want extra security without actually gluing down the wig. But this feels very secure for me with the elastic band and the hooks. Just to show you. She's secure, okay? It's not it's not a loosey-goosey, oops, it's gonna slip off type moment. She's good to go. Now, the construction type is a 13 by six glueless lace front, and it's a 200% density. Now, what does that mean? 200% is exactly this. See how full and just luscious this hair is. It's not thin at all. You are not missing, you know, any density. Like, she is giving full and gorgeous. <laughs> it's amazing. Like, you're going to want to run your fingers through it constantly. It's beautiful. Then the lace color is a tinted transparent Swiss lace, which is a medium brown. And again, for me, flawless. I didn't use anything. I didn't use makeup, concealer, nothing. Took her out the box, styled the bangs how I preferred, and that was it. The part, sometimes you might want to tweak a couple of little things and a wig for the first time is going to be a little bit harder to manipulate the hair in the direction that you want. Because if the hair is already used to going a certain way, you need to redirect it. So what I like using is a hair wax. I haven't used this one in a minute, but it's a good one. I got it on Amazon, so I'll list that below. But this is just a styling wax that's going to help you mold those little hairs down and help you separate it. But always having some alligator clips to really help you, you know, keep everything separated, get a nice clean part, 
and then go on about your day. Now for the bangs, I did my own little like V part just to figure out, okay, what hairs did I want here? What hairs did I not? Just to make it a little easier to manage and to give the little bump. And it was a very slight bump because I didn't want it too curled. I wanted a more relaxed, natural, feathered bang look, which is what this wig gives. And then I'm trying out a new uh, heat protectant spray. Always, 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 if you were using any kind of heat tools on your wigs, protect it, okay? Protect your investment. This is my Tresemme. This is a heat tamer spray, and it says it protects up to 450. I definitely liked how it applied and sprayed. It also has a nice scent, so use, use something. It doesn't have to be this one, but use a heat protectant. This wig is so versatile that it works for the ladies who don't have hair like myself or if you're using this for a protective style, perfect. Slick your hair back, put this on, the style already has you covered whether you use the bangs or you don't. It falls beautifully into the face and it's just, it's so pretty you guys. Like I can't stop stressing that enough, just how gorgeous this wig is and the quality of the hair, like that density, and also the style, like it, it hits different, it just does. And just the versatility of this unit, like if you don't want these bangs in your face, just continue this part down, scoot them to the side, and you don't have to have the bang there, okay? It's giving you full versatility for what you need to do, while also, having that glueless fit. Like the lace quality is so beautiful that you don't have to worry about products laying down the edges and it's styled in such a way that it's going to give you coverage. Like I'm not worrying about the wig going anywhere, anyone even knowing that it is a wig because it just looks so effortless and natural. Now, with that being said, there is nothing wrong with using something to give you a little extra security. Like if you want to pull this hair back, which again you can because it has a lace there, then go ahead and use something. But I always recommend glueless products. So this Go Glueless Spray is a go-to for me. It's not only is it easier for your day-to-day -day, you know, use or wear of wigs, but it's not gonna give you as much buildup or hassle when it comes to cleaning it up either because it's gonna be easier to remove. Thank you so much for joining me in styling this gorgeous wig by RPG Show. I truly hope you enjoyed it, and if you were new to wigs, I hope I helped a little bit in the process of what to do when installing it. And please, please, please comment down below if you have any questions. I am always available to help any way that I can, and I'll see you next time. Bye.